Universidad Austral de Chile. Libertas Capitur. La libertad se conquista. Community Language Learning. Community Language Learning, CLL, is the name of a method developed by Charles Curran and his associates. Curran was a specialist in counseling and a professor of psychology at Loyola University, Chicago. His application of psychological counseling techniques to learning is known as counseling learning. Community language learning represents the use of counseling learning theory to teach languages. In lay terms, counseling is one person giving advice, assistance, and support to another who has a problem or is in some way in need. Community language learning draws on the counseling metaphor to redefine the roles of the teacher, the counselor, and learners, the clients, in the language classroom. The basic procedures of CLL can thus be seen as derived from the counselor-client relationship. Consider the following CLL procedures. A group of learners sit in a circle with the teacher standing outside the circle, a student whispers a message in the native language, the teacher translates it into the foreign language, the student repeats the message in the foreign language into a cassette, students compose further messages in the foreign language with the teacher's help, students reflect about their feelings. Another language teaching tradition with which community language learning is linked is a set of practices used in certain kinds of bilingual education programs and referred to by Mackey, 1972, as language alternation. In language alternation, a message, lesson, class is presented first in the native tongue and then again in the second language. Approach Theory of language the foreign language learner's tasks are to apprehend the sound system, assign fundamental meanings, and to construct a basic grammar of the foreign language. LaForge cites with pride that after several months a small group of students was able to learn the basic sound and grammatical patterns of German, page 47. A group of ideas concerning the psychological requirements for successful learning are collected under the acronym SARD, Security, Attention and Aggression, Retention and Reflection, Discrimination. Design Objectives Since linguistic or communicative competence is specified only in social terms, Explicit linguistic or communicative objectives are not defined in the literature on community language learning. Most of what has been written about CLL describes its use in introductory conversation courses in a foreign language. The assumption seems to be that through the method, the teacher can successfully transfer his or her knowledge and proficiency in the target language to the learners, which implies that attaining neonative-like mastery of the target language is set as a goal. Specific objectives are not addressed. The Syllabus Community language learning is most often used in the teaching of oral proficiency, but with some modifications it may be used in the teaching of writing, as Draynell, 1968, has demonstrated. CLL does not use a conventional language syllabus, which sets out in advance the grammar, vocabulary, and other language items to be taught and the order in which they will be covered. If a course is based on Curran's recommended procedures, the course progression is topic-based, with learners nominating things they wish to talk about and messages they wish to communicate to other learners. Types of learning and teaching activities. As with most methods, CLL combines innovative learning tasks and activities with conventional ones. They include Translation Group work Recording Transcription Analysis Reflection and observation. Listening. Free conversation. Learner roles. In community language learning, learners become members of a community, their fellow learners and the teacher, and learn through interacting with members of the community. Learning is not viewed as an individual accomplishment but as something that is achieved collaboratively. Teacher roles. 
At the deepest level, the teacher's function derives from the functions of the counselor in Rogerian psychological counseling. A counselor's clients are people with problems, who in a typical counseling session will often use emotional language to communicate their difficulties to the counselor. The Role of Instructional Materials Since a CLL course evolves out of the interactions of the community, a textbook is not considered a necessary component. A textbook would impose a particular body of language content on the learners thereby impeding their growth and interaction. Materials may be developed by the teacher as the course develops, although these generally consist of little more than summaries on the blackboard or overhead projector of some of the linguistic features of conversations generated by students. Procedure. The learners are linked in some way to knowers or a single knower as a teacher. The first class, and subsequent classes, may begin with a period of silence, in which learners try to determine what is supposed to happen in their language class. In later classes, learners may sit in silence while they decide what to talk about. LaForge 1983, page 72. The knower may use the volunteered comment as a way of introducing discussion of classroom contacts or as a stimulus for language interaction regarding how learners felt about the period of silence. The knower may encourage learners to address questions to one another or to the knower. These may be questions on any subject a learner is curious enough to inquire about. The questions and answers may be tape recorded for later use as a reminder and review of topics discussed and language used. Universidad Austral de Chile, Libertas Capitur, la libertad se conquista.